Thank you for joining Wars of the Roses as we continue with the Ancient Symbolism series, The Ark of the Covenant, an article taken from Rosicrucian Digest, Volume 11, Number 12, January 1934. The Ark of the Covenant Originally, a temple was a certain area of ground or space set aside for sacred purposes or for worship, where men and women could congregate to make their offerings and to meditate. It was holy ground. It did not mean a structure, but rather a place. It was customary to have in this area a focal point represented by a small structure or altar, which alluded to the presence of God. The central point became known as the Sanctum Sectorum, and the altar became known as the Ark or the Shekinah. Later, when actual structures were erected to house or protect the sacred ground, the Shekinah or Ark continued to be placed in the center. It was the place where the consciousness of God was thought to descend to the mundane. There has come down to us today the belief in most all religions, that wherever man may dedicate a place, a thing, or a condition to God, there the presence of God dwells and makes that place, by virtue of its dedication, holy and sacred. Thank you for watching, and please don't forget to share, like, subscribe, and comment. And if you can, please consider donating to Wars of the Roses. Links to PayPal and Patreon are in the description. Thank you so very much.